Hi guys and welcome to Trinket Corner. Today I am making a mushroom pendant. I don't have a separate oven for polymer clay, so I'm going to be working with air drying clay. I mostly use Fimo Air because it's easier to work with and I like its texture when it dries. When I need to smooth the edges, I simply wet my fingers in water. I use a silicone mat as my working surface because it's easy to clean and nothing sticks to it. In order to make the stem of the mushroom, I simply roll pieces of clay and add them onto the crystal in two sections. I bought this crystal specifically for this project, but you can use anything you have. Natural crystals, chandelier pieces, anything that you like. If the tool stuck to the clay, simply dip it in water. I use the top part of a q-tip to connect the head of the mushroom to its body. I add a little more texture on the bottom. To make white dots on top of the mushroom cap, I use the smallest beads I have. The color of the beads doesn't matter because we are going to paint them over. Simply push them in while clay is still soft. I want to be able to hang this thing, so I'm making a small hole using a chopstick. Because I didn't use any glue, after drying the clay did not stick to the crystal. This is actually good because we are going to be painting the clay after it's dry, and we don't want any paint on the crystal. As usual, I use acrylic paint, the color is natural gray. The beads didn't stick to the clay either, so now I'm going to use PVA to glue every single bead in place and then paint everything in gray again. To be honest, I don't like white color, it looks too cold and unnatural, so for my natural projects, I use slightly beige yellow shade. I use Q-tip to dry brush the bottom and use slightly smaller brush for highlights. I cover the cap in several layers of red.
and finally highlight the beads. I put the hanger of the crystal into the mushroom. To give it a little more whimsical feeling, I decided to glue on this green bead in the middle of the mushroom and add a little moss around it. I forgot to film the part where I glue on the crystal, but that's pretty straightforward. I just added a little PVA on top of the crystal and put mushroom and waited for it to dry. Now this is the final result, I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please give it a thumbs up, subscribe and leave a comment!